feature car subscribe now. Wolfsburg, Germany for a few years after its 2008 launch, the Volkswagen Passat CC enjoyed a respectable level of sales success in the US that peaked at 29,502 in 2011, when it accounted for 9% of the brand's volume. Despite a facelift and a name change to just CC, its momentum receded rapidly, in 2016, the aging four-door coupe was VW's slowest selling model in the US. Despite the negative trend, the automaker is staying in the segment and is getting ready to replace the CC with the bigger, better named, MQB platform-based 2019 Volkswagen Arteon. Where the CC is about the same size as the smaller European market Passat, the Ardeon is almost the same size as the Tennessee-built Passat sold in the US and the Nissan Maxima. A half inch shorter in length than its conventionally styled sibling, the Ardeon rides on a 1.4 inch longer wheelbase, and is 1.5 inches wider and 2.3 inches shorter in height. Compared to the CC, the Ardeon is 2.4 inches longer and rides on a 5.2 inch longer wheelbase. The stretch in wheelbase is entirely in the rear and allows the Ardeon to provide rear passengers with an extra 0.6 inch of headroom, now totaling 37.2 inches. The Ardeon's design is a big win. It's seamless, wide banded front grille. VW was mum on what powertrains we can expect on our shores, but did admit its newest 2.0-liter turbo 4 is our best bet. In the cars we drove, the 2.0-liter put down a claim 268 HP and 258 LBFT of torque, but those power figures are not finalized. Europe's Arteons will arrive with a 7-speed dual-clutch transmission managing the power, but US variants will receive a traditional 8-speed automatic. The DSG-equipped model felt fast enough, charging from 0 to 60 miles per hour in what seemed like the low 6-second range. With the 8-speed, the US Arteon is likely to be a little more sluggish. On the Autobahn, our 4 motion all wheel drive equipped tester was solid, big, and smooth, typically to tonic. When we turned off the Aero Straight Autobahn and onto snaking German mountain passageways, it handled its bulk in a manner befitting the sleek appearance. The selectable drive modes allowed us to soften, stiffen, or smooth out the ride and driver inputs, including steering, throttle, and shift points. When it arrives, the Ardeon should start at around $35,000, much like the outgoing CC. That's competitive with the likes of the Toyota Avalon and aforementioned Maxima, which don't offer the Ardeon's stylish design or flexible hatchback body. While the Ardeon